in tears, in tears, a Florida state rep, Angie Nixon, begs for a ceasefire and says, how many dead Palestinians will be enough? Another rep, a Republican named Michelle Salzman, this rep shouts out all of them. Here it is. We are at 10,000 dead Palestinians. How many will be enough? I also, one of my colleagues just said all of them. Wow. One of my colleagues said all of them. One of my colleagues also stated that this is going to dry up their fundraising if we vote on this resolution. I also want that, like, that's what we've become in this state. That's what we've become in this state where we don't care about innocent babies that don't even get the opportunity to blow out their first birthday candle. This is so sad. Representative Michelle Salzman, do we have a picture of the representative? The, uh, according to the record, uh, this representative shouted out that all Palestinians must die. Let me just provide this for the record. Uh, I have to submit seemingly this every time. Um, once again, Hamas is not Palestine. Palestinians are dying for something they had nothing to do with. Innocent children, innocent people, humanitarian casualty are never okay. They are not disposable. They are human beings. <clears throat> so let's pose it this way. All this is death. And we have elected officials literally saying, kill the rest of them. Talking about baby. Okay. We're talking about people waking up in the morning just like you and I. Getting ready for work. Because we have to pay bills, take care of our family. But they have the added pressure of a random bomb being dropped inside of their community because Netanyahu has used Hamas as a proxy to kill Palestinians.